Hi, I'm James, and in this video, I'm taking a look at Dirt Rally running on Intel Iris 540 graphics. This is one of the Nook chassis with a Core i5 6260U, and we are running at 1366 by 768 and the low detail presets. I did test the game at uh, the medium detail preset, but it seems one or more of the settings going up to medium uh, has quite a big impact on the Intel integrated graphics. I haven't been able to sort of work out which one exactly, so I've just settled for testing on the low. Um, but, I mean, I actually also have tried this at sort of 1600 by 900, and performance is pretty good. Um, we're averaging over 60 frames per second on Iris 540. I think the minimum is about 40 on this run. Uh, there are still some issues, um, notably you would still on sometimes on the in-car view get the sort of kaleidoscope effect over the bonnet which is a bit disappointing that Intel even on the uh, 4444 beta drivers uh, haven't sorted that out yet but you can normally when you're actually playing the game you can get rid of that if it does occur just by cycling the camera normally um, you can see it there where it's just glitched for a moment and it will carry on with that for the rest of the run I'd imagine but it's not on the external views so depending on how you play the game it may not even matter um, but overall yeah a playable experience if you have a Nook with uh, Iris 5 540 or a uh, laptop or ultrabook um, with it you should be able to play the title quite well um, like I say there are a few little graphical glitches during this run but generally a good playable experience I hope you found this video useful uh, I'll be testing more on Iris 540 in the near future so be sure to subscribe if you would like to see that and let us know what other games you'd like to see tested in the comments below as well thanks for watching